Hey, what is going on, guys? Welcome to episode 8 of the Arsenal FIFA 20 career mode. Be sure to leave a like, leave a thumbs up on the video, show your support. If you want to be seeing more of this, I do really appreciate it. So coming off the last episode, things are starting to get really, really tight. Look, Martinelli scores the winner against Man City. We're finding... We're finding our groove right now, uh, which I mentioned this is going to be a very interesting second half. Well, when we get into the second half of the season, not far away, we get in January, maybe some transfer action there. We'll see what's going to happen. Uh, there will be a bit of that, so stick around in this video. Yeah, it's going to be close. We're in seventh right now. As I said, focus on the points differential, only three points off of Liverpool, Man United, even Man City, who we did beat, we got some points off of them. So, yeah, we're not too far away. We gather some wins. Teams on top of us drop points. Uh, yeah, we'll be we'll be looking the goods. Just to review that again, go back on the calendar. Man City, 3-1. So, last game, very, very good there. And we got the likes of Everton up and then Bournemouth. So, I reckon there's a couple games in a row we can win. And then, obviously, Chelsea as well. The upcoming game, that'll be the challenge. They had the bigger team. So if we can win these next three, it'll be really good. Uh, we're at risk of losing two players. Who are those again? Honestly, I'm not sure about either of them, <laughs> to be honest. If we go into the financial, if we go into the contracts, Sobias, he's on loan. I would love to sign him permanently. But yeah, the ones running out the contract, you see this Macy's 66 overall at 25. Yeah, he's nothing special. Uh, Nathan, Tommy, yeah... Nothing at uh, 60 overall. He's probably not going to have the highest potential. Bola, if any of these guys are decent and we should keep on in terms of the younger lads, let me know. But I, I can tell from their overall they're not going to get to that heights that we'll need. Pablo Murray, I know he was a new signing, but he's running out of his contract in the first season. And at 26, 77 overall, he's not a player I would go out to sign as well. So that's what I mean. This squad. First season, a lot of the time, it's not a squad we... Or there's a lot of players in the squad we want to get rid of because there's we can definitely improve it. So that's why we always improve. If you watch my careers from season to season, like the United ones I've done, uh, we always get better uh, because we can get rid of players we don't want in the team and bring in better. Uh, simple as that. But we're going to go in against Everton. How is Everton doing? See, they're 10th. They could be a team that challenges, even though, see... <laughs> you see the positions, 7th to 10th, but we're 10 points clear of them. So that's what I mean. You can see the differential in terms of... It's almost more better to like disregard the position, but look at the point standings. Yeah, point standings, very important to see the difference. Just so if you can see if there's teams you can take over or something like that. But anyway, let's get into it, though. That's a long shot. Oh, that test, Leno. But he did his job and dealt with it. Oh, nah. Well, <laughs> well, I read that perfectly. Okay, yep, that was my passing scheme. I, I totally meant that. It's going to work. It's going to work here. We're going to... Oh, send him off he, right from the back. Send him off. No card. Oh, I'll tell you what. What was that? From, this was from the back, man. Wow. I don't have much to say from that. <laughs> what do you guys think? At a minimum, a yellow. Now it's Draxler. You can play the simple game as well. Just playing off a pass. Torreira. Almost, yeah. Keep that pressure on them. Ooh, that was close to a corner. He saw Oh, Leno. Again, good save. Ah, Terrera. See, Terrera, that's what I mean about the one-on-one -on -one battles. He's a bit of a shorter player. So, what can we say? Oh, no. I thought we would have gathered possession there. So, whenever the ball is going to go out next. Uh, yeah, Terrera, there's maybe some players that's a bit more tired. We've got to bring on Ceballos. I know we've started him in recent games. But again, Terrera, Terrera, Terrera with the 5-6, I feel like in one-on-one -on -one battles, he's a bit weak. Okay, what? What? I did not do that. Oh, guys. Oh, I can't. What can I do? <laughs> what the hell just happened? I did not do it. Oh, my God. God. But that's me being bad at FIFA, I guess. All right. What? what wait. What did I do? I 
Like, I, I pressed continue. I pressed continue and I didn't press it. Maybe I pressed it like two times. Oh, guys. Oh, oh, man. If I lose this, it's going to be seen as a bad game. But that that's the only thing making it 1-0. An accident, really. Off of my quality in this game is 0-0. So, <laughs> come on. Come on. Let's just somehow get this back. It feels... Oh, oh, come on. How come... Where did the shot go? Guys, I want to pause this and... Oh, my God. I just want you to realise this situation. Look here. I press shoot. I, I, like, I'm shooting there, there, there. Why does it let it go so much beyond? I press... It's so simple. I'm only doing something simple. I get the ball. There, I'm pressing shoot. See, look. But why is it... Why does the ball go so far away? You've got to look deeper into it. Apart from the simple things like, oh, you wasted a chance. That's bad. Like, ugh. I don't know what else to change. Nels is 77 overall. And you've got Pepe there, Milinkovic. Savic. I don't know who else in attack to, ta to take off, man. Oh, there's not going to be much opportunities left. Disappointing. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe. Oh, no. Really? For this being a loss. Just... Ah, oh, man. Come on, I can't win the way you're taking so long. Ah, uh, just get take the anger out of the controller. <laughs> Gra grab it, mate. Grab it. No, nah, we're not going to be able to get it. What has happened? Ah, oh, no, nah, we're not going to get it. They're not going to let us get a chance. No, 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 no. Come on, quick. This has to be it. Oh, come on, quick, quick, quick. Quick, quick, quick. Come on. Let us counter. Let us counter. Yes. Oh, look, it's on. Oh, oh you don't call it there, you fucking wank stain. You wank stain. You don't call it there. We're about to score. We're going to create a good... Sh it's, yeah, it's, it's all on me, though. Uh, man, I tried it. I can't believe the style we can see. It was something so minimal. The style we can see that goal was something so minimal. It was continuing, like, from the menu after making a sub. And then, like, the goalkeeper did, a like, a small throw when I didn't even press to do that. The game just must have thought I was, like, pressing the button twice when pressing continue. To resume. Oh man, that's unlucky. That was the that was the difference. Ho ho ho. Are you serial, mate? Are you serial? Uh Bournemouth. I reckon we're gonna sim this one and play Chelsea. So we can get through the games in this episode. Where's Bournemouth anyway? How are they doing? Yeah, they're struggling close to the bottom. <laughs> They've won three games. So alright, yeah, we'll sim this one against Bournemouth. Should be one in terms of the quality. Run over the top of it, 2-0, well done lads. Results we should be getting <laughs> when it's not in affected by bad gameplay. It's not bad. <laughs> oh, damn. It's not bad gameplay, is it? Just me. Da you can't say the game is normal when this is happening. I expect, I'm proud of you. I didn't even put David Louise. You can't say this is, you can't say things are not happening bad that are wrong. Right? <laughs> uh, like, that's... There's errors in the game. You can't deny that. And that's why FIFA... I'm going to say this. That's why FIFA career mode stays bad. Because, like, viewers of, like, YouTube videos, they just say, oh, the player playing the game is bad. Even if there's clear things that's wrong in the game. That's why. We're part of the problem. So, Haaland... Haaland, we... He's one I'm scouting. Took it, taking a look at right here... Obviously, moved to Dortmund. Uh, would love to sign him. Uh, Luis Felipe. He is a young. He's a young centre back. Uh, we're just scouting him a bit more. His contract's running out, so we could be able to get him. Uh, we'll just have to have to see. Got him shortlisted as well. But yeah, this is almost like the Man City game of the last of the last episode. The chance to redeem ourselves. This is, it's basically the same. And if I can get this win against a good team. You see, you, you see how it goes down. Because, yeah, we got, what, 3-1 against City? That was a great result. 
Once more, we might need no ro- We ne- might need some rotations. Sabios, so not exactly full rotations, more quality, what we can get out of him, of Meccano. Well, <laughs> we give David Luiz a chance. He'll, sell, he'll have some attributes boost, as you can see right there, uh, which is pretty handy. Okay, we'll start Martinelli ahead of Draxler. See, I like Martinelli. He's a great young talent and future. I like Draxler too. He might be better as a center midfielder because a lack of pace maybe. But if you're a good player, you can, yeah, not rely on pace. Uh, anyway, anyway, we're going to leave the strikers. And, and I think that's going to be all right. That's going to be all right here. Make sure we have one center back. Holding maybe comes on for Socrates. And yeah, then we're, 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 we're doing all right. Korkchu, maybe he can come on the bench. We'll completely rack. Well, yeah, we'll completely rest. Rest? Rest? <laughs> no idea. We'll completely rest Drax. Uh, Korkchu comes on. Don't forget we sign him. Uh, young talent, he's going to be very good. See, 75 overall at 19, he's a very good player. But, but guys, let's go in against... Ch See, if you look at this team, it is, it is a weak team for a top side. Look, Martinelli started 76 overall and rotate a bit. Tierney at left back, not even rotating there, just... Yeah, we, we've got room to improve in the squad, that is for sure. But let, coming up against Chelsea, let's... Come on, let's go. I just have to get the win. I'm really enjoying the games, in a way, just seeing what's going to happen. They're <laughs> really intrigued. Intrigued by the games, to be honest. Let's see if this one we can flow. Come on. Lacazette. Oh, reading him so well. Come on. Sobias does really well. Oh, oh, look at this, getting in a good position. Pepe. Oh! Oh, how I ripped that skill, man. Oh, if only we could have finished. I'm surprised we didn't actually score. Oh, Giroud, look how big he is. Oh, Sergio Milinkovic Savic. Yes. Oh. Oh, what a skill that was. Let's go. Oh, then more skill. Oh, yeah, get in. Get in there. Get in there. I don't know what I'm doing, though, guys. Like at FIFA. Yeah, I don't know how I did that. Like, because I'm a bad player. <laughs> like, how did I make that happen? Just did the control do it magically by itself? <sighs> yeah, come on, mate. Come on. Hmm. Yeah, I'm getting pumped up. Getting pumped up, I tell you what. I'm, I'm like, why can't I do... Why didn't I do that in the last game? I don't know, guys. There is a rolling level of the difficulty. The more games you see, the more you realise it. <laughs> I swear. Like, look! Where is all this space coming from? <laughs> Even though that chance... Yes, yeah, stopped. But still. Just... Ah, again, good defending. Look. Oh, Martinelli, maybe... He's just got that burst of pace. Go in. Go in. How did he save that? How did he save that? Oh my god, I sound like I did when I was 13. Oh. Oh, he got his foot in the way. That, that was a goal for all money. That was going in the back of the net if he wasn't there. Oh, that's unlucky. That should have been a goal on, you know, on another day. But then he's going to go back. Responsibly. Oh, Lacazette. Oh, yeah. Come on. Come on. It's a route. It's a route 2 0. Hey. We've been very good in this game against Chelsea. I don't know. There's something. When we come up against better teams, we've just got something better. Better is the key word. Look at that little move, then some pace. Lacazette. 11th goal of the Premier League. Season number nine, and that's number 11 for him. Come on. Come on. We just went in this game so hard, man. Yeah, that's better. I'm really happy we're in this position. There we go. Oh, I didn't even expect it to be that good. That's why I moved a bit differently. Didn't expect it to get through, but that's okay. Ah, oh, no, I committed, I know. Yep. 
See, guys? I, I know my mistakes. I know my mistakes. I know them already. While I'm recording this video in the middle of the day, then later I'll edit it and know that someone... Yeah, you talk about the defending. Even if we go on to get three points from it. I know. Trust me. I trust. It just it happens really quickly. It happens really quickly there. I know. I know, guys. Come on. Let's just get the goal back. Let's just get the goal back. Oh! Ah, uh, it didn't work out exactly how I planned. Yeah, trust me, I know what they're defending. But it happens real quick. That's all I can say. Oh, Lacazette! Lacazette! Oh! I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. It's not bad. He stepped up today, Lacazette, hasn't he? Hadn't he? Come on, fans. Yes, he is the hero. Look how beautiful that was. Three goals, the hat trick. Oh, look how he hit that. Smashed it. Lacazette. Ah, Lampard. Yeah, who's the one? Sure, we just conceded a goal, but we got one back. On the 69th minute, yeah, we did it right there. We did it right there. Come on. Make sure we defend. See, I love... It's e See, now we can sit back. I'm not, I don't mean go defensive. I mean easier to defend. When they hit you quick on that counter, and you got players forward as well. Yeah, like, the, like for the goal we conceded. Uh, yeah, we got to try and make an interception. But yeah, game ball. What a performance. What a performance. Lack a Z. <laughs> Lad a Z. What a performance. Against one of the better teams in the league. Pure skill. Pure skill. And yeah, that kind of did happen by itself. Like, it's because Lacazette is a good player. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know, I had to execute a little bit of it. Lacazette did good job. 10 rating. Oh, yeah, we'll go to the post-match interview after that one. What a performance. And as I said, it's not bad for me because I know I, I'm like I'm bad at legend. Well, no, the ultimate, yeah? Ultimate. Yeah, I'm a bad ultimate player, but, you know, I can I can get some wins sometimes. I try my best. Uh, some questions regarding the match. He doesn't sound like he was sure if he wanted to ask me a question. He's like, uh... What? <laughs> How I said, oh, he deserves all the praise. Well, I mean, Lacazette <laughs> as well. As well. Hattrick by Lacazette, yes. Breathtaking performance. He was unleashed. Yeah. Uh, especially win to beat Chelsea. Um, we earned this result. We earned it. Come on, yeah, we just earned it here on the weekend today. Well done. That'll be all. Thank you so much. So we're going to hit up some training there. There we go. There we go. Decent or Nelson. He did pretty well. <laughs> he did pretty well. I said decent. So guys, we are going to continue. We are going to continue a little bit here. Oh, the next... Neck, yeah, we'll do... Oh, Man United's next. It'll be good to do them in the next episode. Uh, outside of this. There we go. Let's see how our youth squad is looking. Declan Lee. Yep. Yeah. Let's see how these guys... Oh, Aiden Evans is looking real good. Sam Price, pretty good as well. But, yeah, I think Aiden Evans could be better. Good center back. See, look at the talents. Alfie Bell, he should settle, yeah, mid-80s potential. Can't be complaining about that. Yeah, Sandoval, 92, 94. He's going to be very good. Wow. So, yeah, guys, we'll leave Man United for the next episode, and it's going to be big if we beat him. How's our goal difference sitting, actually? Okay. But it will be will only be goal difference if we beat United. Yeah, we again points wise not far away, not far away at all. We we sh I show I can beat the better teams like Chelsea, Man City. We've done that. It's you know well the last game the play before that was a bit of an error. It was an error more than anything, uh, like an like not a gameplay error more than just yeah how it played out. Anyway, that's in the back of the mind. Not important now. See, I say that how it's not important. But this is before I'm getting the video up and it'll be <laughs> reminded again. But I, I'm past that, that's for sure. So guys, let me know. Let me know transfers. Uh, as I said, we're going to go pre-contracts. I just wonder if you guys... We've got 700, 700k in the budget. I thought that's good right there. 
uh, to put it like that. So there's a few guys. There's Martinez, who I've just had there previously, but more recently, Haland. He won't move as he recently joined. Cavani, so because of he's a pre-contract, we can approach to sign him. I don't know what you guys would think of that. And then Felipe, Luis Felipe, we can approach to buy him. I think it's a really good deal because he's 22. He's about in the high 70s, even though we're we'll weighed on his overall. Then Mertens. He's a class player, 86 overall. So there's a couple older guys in Cavani and Mertens. They're 32, but they're still quality. We'd have a quality player on our books for next season. So if you agree with any of those guys, uh, I took a look at the players that will be available on pre-contracts. And yeah, in terms of like the better players are generally older. They're generally in their 30s because that's how it goes with, with players and their contracts. You're not going to find someone... You're not, it's not going to be too often anyway. you you got to get lucky. There's going to be some players, of course, in their 20s, mid-20s maybe. But anyway, we're going to leave it there. We're going to leave it there. Of course, the big thing in this episode... the bi- It's been a decent month. If we go back... or December was a decent month. We had... Don't forget Norwich. That was a simulated game when we used the second side. A bit of an... One, once more, a little error. But Man City, the key... Let's focus on the key things. 3-1 against Man City and 3-1, 3-1 against good teams. So against the very best in the league. So that's where you truly test ourselves. And I reckon we did well there. So leave your thoughts. Leave a thumbs up on the video for more of this. You want to see this more. Uh, yeah, I'll greatly appreciate that. See you guys in the next episode. Whew. Another big win. Let's go.